Hey friends, this is Sab. Today I am going to speak to your message called as focus on the cross. Why is it so important for us to focus on the cross? Uh, we know uh, in the book of Numbers, there was a time uh, where the people of uh, Israel sinned against the Lord. And then you know some serpents came uh, and bit these people of Israel. So when the serpents bit these people of Israel, you know what happened? They all cried out to Moses and asked for help. Like, Moses, please help us. So that the Moses told to uh, create a pole and uh, put a, a made a bronze serpent. He said, whoever just sees this thing will get healed. I really, really don't know what exactly how how it worked out over there. He created a pole and told whoever is bitten by the snake just has to see this thing and they will be healed from that whatever that serpent is bitten. But you know one thing, I could have imagined that instead of uh, it could have told instead of serpent, it could have told something else also, your lamb or anything. I don't know why it told only serpent out of you. This is just put the serpent on the on this thing. The same serpent, the serpent which bits uh, you, uh, human beings or the people like that those times, what mother God told that's like 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 a bronze serpent only, but whoever sees the serpent only should get healed out of them. I even I was thinking like what can be this? Why why? It's, it's just uh, this thing. You know, in the book of, uh, in the Gospels, Jesus said this thing. Uh, as Moses lifted up, uh, up the serpent in the wilderness, so some son of man must be lifted up, so that everybody will get eternal life. Wow, I like this thing. So whenever, like, when we speak about the cross, Jesus and the cross, you know, why, why is this so important for us? Why is it something like bronze? Bronze actually represents judgment. Judgment. So in the cross, you know, our sins were judged and it was dealt over there. So today, when Jesus Christ died on the cross for you and for us, everybody, you know, the, now you now no longer into the thing of judgment. It's been dealt. You know, when it speaks about judgment, the, your, your sins have been dealt at the cross. No longer you have, have to think about something called as sin. It's been dealt forever. So now, you know, wherever you need any type of healing, any type of healing, you know, you only have to see towards the cross. You have to see that Jesus has done that thing. He said, he's a done deal. By his stripes you have been healed. You know, only have to, you only have to see this thing. Wow, what a, what a deep secret that God has kept. That you know, have to see that thing. What, what is it actually saying? It's saying like, well, whatever diseases or pain that you have, we need to shift your mindset from this pain towards the cross where your pain has been dealt. Where the pain has been dealt forever. It's been the pain has been defeated. So you know God wants you to meditate on this fact, on the things of the cross, because He wants to shift your consciousness from consciousness from the, the things of pain to the things of cross healing. So whenever you shift this consciousness, healing will start to manifest in your life. I've heard numerous people who ever say that whenever they have their mindset towards the healing, they always get it. You don't have to be a pain conscious, a disease conscious, <coughs> or whatever things are conscious. You have to be Healing conscious, you have to be life conscious, you have to be Zoe conscious. This is what God intends us. He intends us all to shift your mindset from the things of all these things, whatever is troubling you, what and shift your put your eyes a mindset on the things of the cross. Because on the cross it's a new thing. Everything has been done on the cross. Now you have to see yourself after the cross. Don't have to see before anything. It's been, it's been on the cross, it's been dead. Everything. It sees as as I said in the gospel, it sees it was speaking about eternal life. Jesus on the cross and he says he will he be lifted up so that you all can get eternal life. The joy life, the life that God intends us to have forever. This is what he wants us to see. So I want to see whenever you have to uh, whatever problems, whatever things you have, shift your mindset. Shift your mindset from who you are, this your temporary thing, to the, to the problem thing, who you really are towards the cross. When you see yourself towards the cross, you will see the full healing manifest. So the same thing as it was saying, they took serpent only, and there was a serpent out of here, the bronze serpent, so that the people uh, the seeing you get, get, could get it. So similarly, here, you have to see your eyesight, your mindset, your eyesight, everything towards the cross, and you will definitely see the healing manifest. It's only a fact of changing your mindset from the pain mindset to a healing mindset where you are healed forever. Thank you.